Mixer is ready to go. Except parking brake is on. Parking brake. Cut. Cut. Pull it oh. out. Pull it out. Pull out and down. Okay. And turn. Okay. So now it's ready to go. Just accept brake. That's mill power. Push it more. That's the afterburner. Okay. And there's a nice does, notch. The airplane does not require afterburner to take off. Fills up. Release. Landing gear up. Hands off, it's okay. Hands off, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Now, do this. Um, stay, stay, stay full throttle. Okay. Okay. Now, nose up more. Come on up. We gotta go vertical. More okay. Up. More up. Wow, let's go 90. Yes, sir. We're gonna go 90. 90 degrees. <coughs> now release it. Yes. You're going straight up. Remember, you mm -hmm. just took off. Yeah. You did not nose down to get more speed. Mm -hmm. Nose up more. So. Right now more. You're 11, okay. feet up. Pull back on the stick more. Pull it on back. Pull it on back. Pull, pull back more. 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 Pull. That's pull. the runway you took off. From. Yes. Hello, home. So, Mach 1 approaching, okay? Yeah. Okay, and Mach 1. Yes, sir, Mach 1.03. Yep. Uh, no, let's see. Yeah, climbing. Now you're starting to decelerate. Yeah, I went to the normal. The indicated the triangle is below your flight path, you're decelerating. Mm hmm. Which is still supersonic. Yes. And you're still climbing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So just like just like in in in, in, your, in your car, right? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of information on the dash. Mm -hmm. But what are you looking at when you're driving? Well, it speed. It depends. Oh, wait, yeah. You want to know. Interesting. Same thing is here. The information is there, but you're looking at what you are interested in at that particular time. Mm hmm. Let's see. The home was. Is that the home base? Now, here's another flight, here's another end pin. That little here. Ah. The steering to your selected waypoint. Okay. So right now, he's pointing at the runway, which is behind you on the left-hand side. There it is. Okay. Release the stick. Now it's telling you that it's in front of you, but slightly left. Mm-hmm. But it's only 12 miles away. You would think you should be able to see ah, it. Ah, right? yes. Now, with your helmet, uh, that's with your helmet, you would be able to look down there and see it. Mm. Right? It's right yeah. Over there. And this is locking. That's lock, lock, it's locked it into not, it. It's yeah. not locked. Okay. It is the target is clear. It is all. It is looking in the direction of your waypoint, your steering oh, point. Okay. When you don't have a target selected. If you have mm. a target selected, it's going to look in, 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 at, your, at the target. So yes, it's looking, looking at the airflow right now. Yeah. It's keeping keeping it steady all the time, even through I'm But now we can't see it. Oh, okay. Because that sensor it's is under the front of the airplane. Okay. It's in yeah. this window. It's in this window right there, right? Yes. And now that if that runway is behind you, it's on your left hand side, and you roll left, it can't see through the jet. Mm. That's why that's why it goes blank. But you do have another sensor here. The dash display, air to surface, ah. different sensors, the same one for the helmet. Mm -hmm. oh. But as you roll the aircraft, oh, sorry. Now that runway Just a is second. I will have to. Yeah. That was not running. <laughs> so that runway okay. is on the left hand side there, right? Yeah. So roll the airplane over. Roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. Roll. Roll. Over. Stop right there. Okay. Look in the cockpit. I can't mm. see it, but this still does. Okay. 360 degrees, all yes. aspects. All directions. Okay. So they're both looking in the same point. Mm. Right now, they don't have to be, but they are. But one will always be able to see in that direction. Mm. You can also 
also make this thing look straight down. This is what's oh, directly below you. Okay. So no matter how you maneuver the aircraft, you'll be able to see what's directly below you. Mm. Uh, this is uh, 34,000 feet. Yes, 34, okay. Feet. Hmm. With the airliners. Yes. <laughs> I'm still maneuvering really well. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And you're in uh, military guard. You're not full, you're not full, full throttle either. Yeah. No, no. Here's what the rudder does, okay? Go ahead and get the wings up. Stay right there. Now, push on the rudder pedal. Yeah. All it does is move the nose left and right. Mm. Right? So if you were on the ground and you were taxiing around, yes. it just moves the nose around the right. If you're in a stovel aircraft, the mm. model, and yeah. you're in a hover, zero airspeed in the air, mm. push on the rudder pedal, it's going to move the nose just like that. Same thing. Yes. <laughs> How it does it is differently. The effect is the same. Is touch screen. Mm -hmm. What that does is allows us to use to better utilize all the space. Yes. If you had changing if you changing had information. Not just yeah. changing information, how, changing how it's presented. Yes. So if you had buttons around your MFD like a, like a traditional fighter aircraft mm -hmm. with the with, with the display and the buttons around it, you can control the display. That fixes the size of the display. Okay. Since mm. we use virtual buttons, now mm. I can virtually make that picture bigger. Ah, okay. Now the buttons would be further down, right? Mm. All allocated for that display. Hmm. <coughs> if I want to, I can make it bigger still. Ah, oh, okay. That's so, some, some people will say that with 12 video formats, one, two, three, four, mm. each one having two more. Yeah total of 12, that's a lot of information. That's too much information. It's too much too much to look at. Well, well, you have the option to scale that down and make it two displays if you want to. Yes. Right? <laughs> you want yeah. to? Got to. Depending on the needs and the mission. Depending, yeah. depending on, on your capacity mm. to interpret information. Understand, too, that this airplane is designed more, more for the younger generation that's going to be flying it Right? Yeah. What do they do now? A lot of video games. Right? <laughs> yes. And as they're flying and playing those video games, they're switching things around all the time. They're keeping up with it because they have the mental capacity to keep up with mm -hmm. it. So it's much easier. I'm not saying that the older people can't do it. <laughs> I'm just saying it takes it takes that training, right? Yes. They're, they're doing that now. Right? Yeah. The pilots that fly the F-16 are very capable of flying this aircraft because it's the yes. same kind of uh, same kind of heritage, right? We make the F-16, we make this with the F-22, we make this with the yeah. So a lot of the philosophy, a lot of the terminology, a lot of the controls are very similar. Hmm. So that training is greatly reduced because you already know how to do that. Right? Yeah. Here's just, just more, ca more, more capability. <laughs> hmm. Sounds like that. Or some weather for air surf. <laughs> not, not good for air surf, right? Eh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Closing really fast. Sensor control. Sensor right. Okay, right. Move that down to the square. Ah, okay. On the white. On the white. Up. Designate. Okay. Transport one time. Got it. 
zoom it in. Get the other one. Move the cursor to the other one. Down, down, down. down. Got it. Yes. Yeah. Got it. Now, okay. turn right. Let's go, let's go kill it. Full throttle. Continue to pull it back on the stick. There you go. Okay, while you're doing all that, use your left thumb on the top switch. Left thumb, top switch. Click right. Just click right. Put your finger on top of the switch. Click, put your finger on the top of the switch. Click right. Right. Got it. Okay. Got missiles on. Come right more. Right up there. Is that? Is that? Got it. Right yeah. there. Relax. Get the wings level. Stay right there. Mm -hmm. So now you're flying in towards this airplane. Full throttle. Okay. Now you actually in range, and if you want to shoot it, push that red button one time. That's enough. Okay. Doors opening up. This is coming out. Okay. And what did I shoot? Amram. Amram. Yes, sir. Okay. And the other one. To get to the other one? Yeah. Don't use the rudder. You've just fired at this one. I think you thought you fired at that one. Oh, ah, okay. This one is your primary target. Okay. To change the priority, move this switch to the right. Now it's looking okay. at the other one. This okay. target player is looking at that airplane. Mm -hmm. Your airplane has detected a missile in the air. Yep. That's why I put that symbol there. That, sen that sensor is at Missiles going down toward that aircraft on the right hand side. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's the missile. You don't have to, you've already selected it. Okay. And, uh, okay, it's a I'm hit. I'm going to move this to the right. You can see yeah. it actually here going down. Ah. Oh. Right? I can actually okay. make distance to look at the air target as well. Mm hmm. Right? Move this to the right again. There's okay. the other one, right? Okay. Um. If you want, you can fire it that one, which you already did. Yeah. You did not have to wait for the first one to get hit. Yeah. You could fire one. Change to the other one, fire the second. Mm -hmm. So what's the range? Where do I see where do I see the range to target? Six miles. Ah, okay. It's on the box. Yes, it's here too, but it's right it's right in front of you, so we have to look yeah. down in the cockpit. Okay, um Got hit the again, head. yeah. Okay, what's that dot in front? <laughs> Curse you, he jumped out. Okay. <laughs> so now you actually right. need to go land. Hmm. Weapons off, left thumb, top switch, down the middle. Down middle, down middle. Push not back, no. down the center. Watch. Down center, okay. And push back yeah. navigation button. Okay. Okay. Now where's the runway? I have no idea. What's the symbol telling you? Those uh, are down there. Oh, on the right. Okay. Behind you. Yeah. Oh, and uh, how far away is it? More or less. 16 miles. Ah, uh, oh, oh, that's it. So yeah. Again, the information is there. Right? Mm -hmm. It's just a matter of getting used to or getting comfortable with where it is located. Yes. And uh, I was actually I was in uh, 8,000 feet originally, and now I'm in 30,000. I just climbed without, no, without noticing because while attacking. Because you were chasing yeah. that aircraft, yeah. right? And, yeah. and your airplane is like, okay, whatever. Yeah. It doesn't matter. It's okay to do that. Now, it's only 14 miles oh. away, you should be able to see it. Yeah, you it's right down there. Steer to the right, stop right there. Very soft, very gentle, not so much. Pull back on the throttle. Alright? Because as you nose down, you may be still increasing speed. Yeah. And you're already 500 knots. Yeah. 10 miles away. Nose it down more. Nose it down more. Stop right there and wait. Stay right there. Now, the air brake switch is where your thumb is now. Oh, that. Pull okay. That back. Got it, that's enough. Now it's full braking. Line goes all the way down. Speed brake indicator. Ah, okay. So we're slowing down as quickly as it can. Mm hmm. The reason we're using maximum speed brake is because we're so close. And yeah. We're so fast. Yeah. Start to bring the nose up. Only up. Yep. That's enough. Now you can actually close the brake a little bit off. Close it off. That's enough. One more time. Now, toward the runway, stay there, and up. Right. Oh. Which one you want? Left or right? Right. <laughs> stay there, nose it up. 